What's up guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable AMT, make sure to hit up my sponsor and use code BUGS for 5% off checkout. Links down below in the description. Hit them up right now. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video and guys today we do have some market content, auction snipes, all that good stuff. Before we get into the video, make sure to smash that like button, drop the sub if you are new because that would be greatly, greatly appreciated, man. We are on the road to uh, 13,000 subscribers and today we're pretty much just going to go over to auction house and whatnot. Um, please smash the like button. If you guys want, I'm selling MT on Twitter and Instagram. Um, if you guys are new, you need MT, make sure to hit me up on those socials. Um, but yeah, we're pretty much just going to go over the best things to snipe right now, how to make MT right now and all that good stuff. Even with this annoying, annoying auction house bug right now, it's like super frustrating. All these snipes I'm missing because the auction house bug is on full effect right now. Uh, it's really tough. So I'm going to show you what I'm investing in right now. I did drop about 100k on pack, 100 like 80k on packs. Didn't really get too much. But um, we're pretty much just investing in Amethyst 20s right now, man. This is going to be your best investments. Um, so far, I got Curry. I got two Kawhis and a Kevin Durant. We are trying to snipe some out. As you guys do know, all these cars showing up on the auction block are all bought already. So that's probably the biggest thing right now, man cards on the auction are just literally broken like these cards were bought literally minutes ago some even hours ago and it's kind of frustrating because when you're sniping you have to scroll over big time and right now with scrolling and whatnot it's not looking too good all these snipes are kind of covered up by the auction house bug and whoever got these snipes is going to make a lot of mt it's just very frustrating so we're gonna go over some filters right now one filter I'm going to show you is obviously the diamond filter. Alonzo Morning is already dropping in value. I just sold mine for 73k. We did actually pull the card. So um, right now, man, diamond filter is probably going to be your best bet. Also, not only that, some cards, limited cards. Like if you guys didn't see the limit requirement, it's people who scored 40 points in the NBA game. So Kobe most likely to go up in value. I think for 85k, I might have to scoop him up. Um, yeah, I'm going to scoop him up for that price because. I think his price goes right back up to 100,000 MT. Not gonna lie. Same with Kareem Abdul Jabbar. Kareem Abdul Jabbar is most likely to go up in value because he obviously did score more than 40 points in an NBA game. So he is usable for unlimited or limited in this week. So if you can scoop up a Kareem for like 30 something K, that's a W. I can see his price going up to like 30 something K. So definitely recommend that pretty much. So if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, limited online. I'm gonna show you real quick. So all players must have scored 40 points in an NBA game. So if you guys want, you could focus on that. These are the players I invested in so far. They're going to rise most likely tomorrow or the next day. So some filters, Amethyst NBA 20, one of the best filters in the game still to this day. It's been the best filter. Ooh, give me that. See what I'm saying, man? All these are getting bought out by somebody and it's pissing me off because I can't buy them. There's no way I could actually get my hands on these. There we go. We got one of them. These cards are going to rise big time, and I'm guaranteeing that. Most of these cards are going for lots of MT. So all those players who scored more for 40 points on the limited, I think Kawhi has scored 40 points before. Same with KD, definitely scored 40 points before. So these cards are definitely going to go up in value, even if they weren't in the limited. This is my best filter by far. Also, Ruby filter should be going crazy right about now. Oh, Patrick Mills at 1K. In my opinion, I think Patrick Mills for 1K is a very very good investment very good investment i think he goes at the 2k this is a very very good budget player these are probably all bought already yeah these are all ball but why do i say he's a very good budget player guys he's a great three much shot great mid range for budget players this is going to be a very good point guard guys so if you guys want try sniping out patty mills not only that a bunch of other players should pop up on this filter patty mills should be a very good investment i say he goes up to 2500 rubies have been all the way up to like 3000 4000 in the last couple of days and right now man i'm gonna buy that and we missed it right now man this auction house bug is really getting to my head it's super frustrating it's very hard to snipe right now but right now man amethyst 20 another one an amethyst filter has kind of been ruined due to the spam of Luis Scola's not uh, getting bought out and still being up on the auction um amethyst filter should be popping i guess you have to kind of do it by position now because as you guys can see man all these most of these Luis Scola's have pretty much been bought out there is a spam of Luis Scola's he's probably the easiest amethyst to pull because i pulled him so that means it's very easy to pull him 
but right now man the auction is super broken the way to make mt is most likely going to be sniping those amethyst 20s investing in them that's the way i'm making my mt buying cards who scored over 40 points in nba in uh in their career that's probably gonna be your best way to make oh that's a snipe and i missed it of course because that card is not actually there that card was already bought out that's a snipe and i missed that one too do you see what i'm saying these cards were already bought out and they're still on the auction that curry was bought out this kd was bought out and this is what i'm dealing with so you have to kind of be patient with sniping as of right now i bought that one that one's gonna go up to at least 25 30k Kawhi Leonard 2900 you're just gonna have to deal man i'm telling you all these cards right here they were bought out already this is the only problem with 2k right now man their auction house bug is completely ruining sniping when will they fix this problem i'm not totally sure but here are some top snipe filters i'm going to show you we got this filter we got diamond filter we also got center amethyst um we got kareem and Kristaps on there unless you just want to snipe out Kristaps, that's cool too kareem for 40k is not a bad price and then we got uh i think it's nix Przingis. so if you want to go over to center nix Przingis is definitely a very good snipe filter as well and uh yeah nix Przingis is going to be up there in value he's a very good card probably one of the best centers in the game at 7-3 great three-point shot i mean he's an all-around beast he's got a great block great wingspan so he's definitely gonna be up there in value if i did miss one for 35k earlier so i mean it's, ooh, that's kind of good value i'm not gonna buy it i want to try to get him for 30k and under there should be a lot of snipes on this Przingis card he is a very expensive amethyst so i don't know man it's completely up to you guys on what you want to do there's a lot going on in NBA 2K21, my team. And one of the biggest things right now is definitely the auction house glitch. It's really pissing me off. But honestly, if I were you, if you have some MT to burn, Amethyst 20s are definitely going to be your best bet. Definitely your best bet because, oh, and that's gone. Um, I'm just going to continuously sit on this Amethyst 20. I'm most likely investing every single bit of MT on the Amethyst 20s. This is going to be your best bet. So every single MT today, I had about 550K. It's all getting invested in cards because I'm going to make a, at least 5,000 MT per pop even after the reduction. You will see, man. I will be making lots of MT off this. This is going to be my best method. Not only that, man, Diamond Shoes. Definitely a good method right now. Um, diamond Shoes. Let's check it out. Um, I'm on contract cards. Shoes, Diamond, Nike. I invested in a lot of Nike shoes. So if you want to make some MT this way too, it's definitely not a bad idea diamond shoes were on the what's it called they were on the um i'm gonna buy that one too they are on the spin this week so you're gonna see them drop in value big time there's really just a lot of things you could be doing right now there's a lot and as you guys can see these diamond shoes i bought a ton of these diamond shoes i'm gonna show you that's why i'm pressing enable i'm trying to get some of these kds oh you gotta go over to nike I'm trying to focus on the Nike shoes. You want to focus on KDPEs. That's probably the ones you want to focus on. They have the most value. The Kobe XIs are also very valuable. Those are the shoes I am looking for right now. But uh, yeah, man, other than that, that's really all we got for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Stay tuned for more content, guys. Try to snipe out all the cards I just showed you. Let me know if the auction house glitch is bugging you down below in the comments. But yeah, that's all we got for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Have a good one. Peace. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure you hit me up on Instagram and Twitter. I am buying and selling MT. Hit me up right now.